I should be running number 463, NaNoWriMo Day 21. But I've only got 50,000 words to go before the end of NaNoWriMo. I thought that it'd be easy, but it's not. Yeah, I've only got 50,000 words to go before the end. Hi there, welcome to I Should Be Writing, the podcast for wannabe fiction writers. I'm your host, Murr. And, it, you know, I've been uh, looking into doing YouTube stuff, and I watch some YouTube advice things, and one guy's like, if you haven't done it in a while, then don't, don't say why, because people don't want to hear that. But I'm thinking, you know what, if I promised a monthly podcast, I should probably mention why I failed to do it monthly. Or rather, week daily. Good lord. That could be a reason, right there. Um... I've just had two bad days of being far too busy to sit down in front of the mic. Lots of uh, family, domestic stuff, some of it unexpected, and all of it tiring. But things have calmed down now, and I'm in a better mental place. And I feel like if I'm doing a self-care podcast about NaNoWriMo, half of my episodes are going to be about just freaking forgive yourself. But specifically, here's the deal. If you are having a day where you, nothing's working. Absolutely nothing is working. You just, you can't focus or nothing, all the words, you honestly do not know what happens next in the novel. Or everything's on fire in your life and you just really can't focus on your book right now. It is better for your mental health to go, I'm going to step away and take some time off rather than sit there and sweat and enter the closet of self-loathing because you don't get anything done. And at the end of the day, you get the same amount of work done. I kind of wish I'd done that. I kind of wish I'd done that at the beginning of the day, but um, I finally did that yesterday. I went and did some recording with Ursula, uh, writing with Ursula Vernon, and then the words weren't coming. I don't know what happens next to my book. I hate my book. I got some done. A lot of it was notes to myself of, why am I doing this? I don't write romance. I don't know what to do next, etc. And then I just went home and said, you know what? I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm not saying I'm quitting NaNoWriMo. I'm not saying I'm quitting the book. I'm saying... I was done with the day. And if you don't let yourself breathe, then you're going to drown. And I know no matter how many times I say it to you, or let's be honest, how many times I say it to myself, it still may not fully, we're not going to believe it, but I have to keep saying it, which is, it's okay if you don't hit your 50,000. You're still writing. You're still getting words done. You're still getting more words done than you would have. I don't even know what my word count is right now. I don't know if I want to know. Because I think the goal right now, we're at, what, 36,000? That sounds about right. Yeah, I think we're at, the goal is 36, 666 today. I am not... I was getting within 10,000, and now I'm way outside of 10,000. Behind. So even though I've said it before, probably this month, of just forgiving yourself, I'm going to say it again, but I'm going to say if you need to take time off, try to recognize it and take the time off, because you will get just as many words written, and you won't have as much self-loathing as you would if you just sat there and wished you could write and failed to write and then hated yourself. And by you, maybe I just mean me. I don't know. But it's, uh, it's been a cruddy couple of days. But we have the weekend coming up. I am not traveling for Thanksgiving. And I'm not cooking a huge feast or hosting a bunch of people. So the usual cooking and cleaning and cooking and cleaning stress will not be there for me. 
But I apologize for not getting a daily show to you guys. Hope you can forgive me on that. And I'm going to throw another load of laundry in, and then I'm going to write. It is before noon. Yes, it is before noon on Thursday, and I'm hoping I can get some good words down. Honestly, I'm a little afraid because, really, I don't know where this book is going. I don't like where it's going. I don't, I don't know how to connect the pieces of a romance. I've read plenty of them. This is a completely new genre, and anybody who tells you romance is easy, they just haven't tried it yet. I don't care if it's got a formula or what, but, um, yeah, that's, that's it. So, I will talk to you tomorrow. Good luck on your writing. If you are, I think some of the people in the Discord are done or close to done. That's awesome. And as for the rest of us, keep going. It doesn't matter. Think about it this way. Let's say you've got, oh, 21,601 words to pick something at random. If you quit now, at the end of the month, you'll have 26,601 words. If you keep going, at the end of the month, you may not have 50, but you'll have more than 21,601. And I totally picked that number out of the air. Keep going, guys. I'm going to try to keep going. Because you should be writing. You can support the podcast and get a full 30 days of NaNoWriMo goodness at patreon.com slash mightymurr. Music by John Anilio. johnanilio.bandcamp.com Use with permission. Thanks, John. So